During the contract stage of your home buying experience, your realtor will negotiate a sales price on your behalf. On the majority of purchase agreements, you will find an earnest money deposit or initial deposit. Think of this as a handshake of commitment. Typically, you can expect this deposit to range from 1% to 3% of the property's purchase price. But again, this is part of the negotiation that will be done prior to signing a purchase agreement. Other items that will be negotiated prior to signing a contract are repairs, fee obligations, whether the buyer or seller will pay which fee, and even potential credits. If you listened to our video about why it's a good time to buy, then you heard us mention seller credits. Seller credits are funds the seller gives the buyer at closing as incentive to purchase the property. The credit can be used to help cover closing costs, costs of repairs needed, or buying the buyer's interest rate down. Seller credits are not the same thing as seller paid fees. There are also fees within the closing costs that can be covered by the seller. Or in some states, certain fees are required to be covered by the seller. The fees will be listed in the purchase agreement. The next cost to discuss, down payment. This is a fee you will discuss with your loan originator. Depending on the loan product you qualify for, your down payment can range from 3.5% to 5% minimum. There are some loan products that offer 0% down payment, but you must qualify for that product. One thing to note is that on a conventional loan, if you have a down payment of 20%, your loan will not require mortgage insurance, but this is not always the best option for everyone. It is important to speak with your loan originator about the different down payment options that you have so you are making the best decision for you and your financial needs. The rest of the fees would fall under your closing costs. Closing costs are all the fees that have come about throughout the process of creating your loan. The fees vary from an appraisal fee, credit report, title service costs, property taxes, and your first insurance payment. Within these fees, you will also find government fees that are required to be paid by the state that you are purchasing in. A buyer can estimate that their closing costs be anywhere from 3% to 5% of your purchase price. When you get to the closing table, you will be asked for your cash to close. This is your down payment plus your closing costs combined. It is essential to keep an eye on your financial planning as you navigate through the various components involved in purchasing your dream home to ensure you are not left with any surprises.